Hey guys, it's me, Jess, and welcome to another video. Today's video is going to be a Goodwill Blue Box unboxing, and this one's going to be shoes. So every Friday, a Goodwill Blue Box on their website has mystery boxes for sale. Most of the time, I usually get the 10 for 10 because it's really cheap and I can always, always make my money back with it. But last week, I saw that the 10 for 10 was available and I saw that the shoe boxes were available. So I went ahead and grabbed both. If you would like to see my 10 for 10 video, I'll link it up above so you can go watch it. But the shoe box is usually pretty good. I have personally only gotten sneakers in my boxes and I'm not really a sneaker girl, but my sneakers in, the, in these boxes have sold really well. So I decided to give it another shot. Also, this shoe box cost me $34.99. It was $29.99 plus $5 shipping. And you get five pairs of shoes, which puts each pair of shoe at $7 which I don't think is too bad, but my Goodwill prices shoes around $4, but I'm not really sure what it prices sneakers at because I really don't look for sneakers in my Goodwill. Again, not a sneaker girl, but I do love finding out new brands and learning new things. So that is why I like to order these boxes. All right, enough chatting, let's get into the box. Okay, so apparently I got a little bonus. I got some Paracord shoelaces, they are fire starters so i don't know if these are something from amazon they look like maybe they're three dollars maybe that's a garage sale sticker i mean here's the other one i'm not sure if i can sell these maybe i can lot them together and get like i don't i don't know maybe 777 <laughs> if i take off that sticker that might not be worth listing but it might be an easy listing so we'll see Okay, just by looking in the box, it looks like it's mostly sneakers. So the first pair are a pair of New Balance. These seem to be in pretty good condition. They do have a little bit of dirt on them. These are a seven and a half. I'm not sure if they're men's or women's. They kind of look like women's. I might actually be able to wear these myself. They're pretty cute. Uh, there is just one stain. Oh, there's two stains. So there's a little stain Good job, Chloe! She's playing Roblox, so this is my distraction for when I do videos. Ooh, yikes. Um, <laughs> I have sold this brand in the past. I, It's Avia. I, I think that's how you say it. It's just a pair of men's shoes. They're pretty plain. I did used to sell Avia shoes all the time. I'd buy them retail arbitrage at Walmart. And I'd sell them for like $25, but they were like brand new. I'd find them for like five. I don't do that anymore, obviously. <laughs> um, but so I'm not sure how well used shoes are going to go over that are Avia. And these, I mean, they're in good shape. So maybe I could get like 15, maybe 20 at best. Um, but I'll, I mean, I'll be putting comps over there. And, um, and then my listing will be right there. They surprised me and... <laughs> gave me a pair of sandals, uh, wedge sandals. They're by the brand Aldo, which I don't try to pick up at all <laughs> in the thrift stores. I don't think I'd pay $7 for these. They are really cute and they have this little Aldo, little buckly thing right there. <laughs> these are in really good shape. I don't think they've ever been worn. They were $20 somewhere. Wait, oh, okay. That makes more sense. Um, these are from Ross. They are brand new and they're a size 11 don't think I'm going to get over $20 for these. So I'll probably end up selling these for 15, maybe 20. Um, yeah, again, I'll see if I can find any comps and then my listing will be off to the side. Okay. So we have some Nikes and these are kind of just plain Nike, like tennis shoes, uh, low tops. And there's a, <laughs> there's a lot of dirt right there that I'll have to clean off. But besides that, they look to be in decent condition. Again, I will do some cleaning on these. They are a size eight. I'm not really sure, are these men's or are they women's? So I will have to do some research. And again, I'll post stuff over to the side and we'll hope that these are a good shoe. Oh, these last shoes look interesting. Oh man, these are youth shoes. But look how cool these are. They're a pair of Nikes. I think they're called the Air Max because I think me or my brother used to have these, uh, no, Shocks, maybe Air Shocks, um, Shock Nikes, Nike Air Shocks. <laughs> I don't know. 
Uh, we'll have to do some research, but look at that. Uh, it has like the Nike logo written right there in the swish or the swoosh right there. These are a pretty cool pair of shoes. So hopefully when I look these up, they are decent and will <laughs> will sell for more than $35. That's what I'm hoping for these because they're just so cool. But again, being kids, I'm not sure. They uh, do need a lot of cleaning, but I can do that. And I don't know if I told you, these are a six youth. So, I mean, if you're interested, let me know. And yeah, we will um, go with that and see how they do. Okay, that was my Goodwill Blue Box. They do drop every Friday at 5 p.m. Central Time. And if you are interested in a box such as this, Make sure you're on the website at that time because the shoe boxes sell out a lot faster than the clothing boxes. But not quite as fast as that Y2K box. That is a hard box to get. All right, that is it for me. If you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. I really appreciate it. Please make sure you're subscribed to my channel down below. Thank you so much and have a great day. Bye.